Now, you both have a lot in common. We do. Because you both have uh, quite extreme phobias. Right? Yes, I like, do. Uh, but like, Paulie, what, what, what are your, what's your biggest phobia? Well, I have a lot of them. And the, the rule is that if you have phobias, and I'm sorry out there, anybody that does, because they're quite serious. Yeah. You never tell anybody what the big ones are. But you, there's other, like, fringe phobias you can talk about. Like, like... Say I I am terrified of ovens and of ovens. Yes, I don't own an oven. That I don't. I can't ovens. Yes, no. Microwaves are fine, but right. Um, but ovens, no. Yes, no. And then um, but don't you own a movie bakery? theater? I own a bakery. Yeah. In New in New York. Yeah. So would you not go near the ovens? It's like three thousand miles away. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, you own it. Presumably, you've been there. Do they go? Oh, come see the kitchen. And you're like, no. No, I, I, I you know I do pretty good over there. And I'm terrified of movie theater, so I've not been inside a movie theater in probably like 20 years. And uh, magicians, big one, big time. You're, sorry, scared of magicians? D scared is an understatement. What is it about them that's terrifying? Everything. I mean, it's all about deception, it's all about foolery, it's all about something, and I can feel them coming from like a mile away. Well, you'll feel it now. Please welcome. No, I'm joking. I... I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm absolutely kidding. Um, that's an amazing thing to be scared of. You think it's amazing? But, well, I kind of, it's just not one of those things that you hear. Well, I ask him what his is. Go on. Um, I hate balloon animals. <laughs> See? You know the guys in the mall that makes the balloon animals? My wife and I walk like a mile around that guy huh? because he's there going, hey, hey, hey. Oh, so it's, it's well, the hang on, sound I don't, of it. I don't know if people know what you're talking about. Don't, hey, 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 hey. No, I'm saying, oh, no, I'm saying, you mean, don't you mean fun. like, no, I'm not making fun. I'm saying, it's, fun is, is it that sort of noise? Yes, yeah, that is that noise? Thing. Yes. That so if someone says, oh, is oh, that, yeah, that's that the one yeah. that. Yeah, that would be yeah, it. That's no. the one that, so it's like, if you're just like, oh, no, it's, twist it there. You make a poodle or went, something. What are you worried about, Perrette? It's not your phobia. Because you can do a magic trick at any moment. I'm not going to do a magic trick. That could turn into a rabbit. Or no, it's not. It I've, looks like a rabbit. I've made a hat <laughs> for a very small child. That's what I've done. But what, what, what is it about it that's really scary? It's the sound of it. I'll yeah. stop it. I'll stop it. Okay, I'll stop you, here's it. the thing I say there about phobias is, is by definition, they are um, they're irrational fears. Yeah. So therefore, we don't have to rationalize them to you. I'm not saying that you do. <laughs> It's gone. It's gone. But well, thing... needles. I hate needles. needles oh my yeah, God, I am the worst. For it. But you're but so needle, hard. But, but you're such a, a rocker. A needle around a balloon is fine with me. <laughs> you know. but, but you mean if you're going for like oh, a blood test or something? They can put my head in a, a guillotine. They can put the snake around me. They can hang me on stage. Everything. A blood test is like two weeks of me sitting there and going. <laughs> oh, I don't know about that. I haven't had a shot probably in you know. 30 years, 40 years. Really? Please don't pull I out just... a shot. No, okay. don't worry. Oh, I'm even, not going to. I didn't even think about that. No, I'm not. No, I'm not, I'm not good. I'm not, I don't mind a shot, like, you know, in the, when they do the one in the ass and they just... Yeah. Burn, like, I actually... We were shooting here before we had to... Uh, before we'd launched, and we were doing a, a piece in a, a sneaker shop, and I had a really, really sore throat, so a doctor came to the sneaker shop, and in the changing room of this sneaker shop, she said, uh, I'm going to give you a shot. I said, I'm really not good with needles. She was like, I'll do it in your ass. And she, I just went, I'm just too, I went, just do it quick, do it quick. So I, I'm in, just in the middle of a shop, <laughs> pants pulled down. And she just went like this. She went, smile, and then she went, bang, and put the needle in. Spanked me. What is it, cortisone? What was it? I don't know. It was hard to remember. I had such an erection. But, <laughs> um, 